Hello YouTube, thought I'd do a quick video here, something a little different than all the uh, other videos I've been doing lately, but uh, a question was asked, does the leaves on the trees interfere with GMRS two-way radio uh, distance? Now obviously GMRS, the frequencies, you know, line of sight. So I thought I would go back in my videos and I found a video I'm at the same location. I'll post the video, that video link in the description below. I was at this same location when it was fall and there was no leaves on the trees. I'm using the same gear. Um, as you can see, I'm using the uh, handheld hooked up to an amplifier like I did in the other video. Uh, that particular video that I was doing back, I don't remember if it was February or what the date on the video was. I was doing, um, does more wattage give you more penetration or distance? But one of the locations I was at was here. And I say in the video that, hey, you know, it's, it's, it's you know, wintertime or fall or whatever it was. The trees don't have leaves on there. So that's going to make a difference. So now I'm back at the same location. Um, we got the same radio gear. Everything's the same. The only thing a little different is I have a different repeater, um, but the wattage output is the same. When I did the other video, I had the Redivis RT97. Now I have the Redivis RT97S. When I checked the wattage, it's about 6.5, 6.7 watts going into the coax cable. That's about the same as the other repeater, if I remember right. So um, I just want to point that out. That's the only difference. I got the same antenna, same antenna height. Um, matter of fact, if you look on your screen, I have the terrain graph up from this location to my repeater. And you can see it being a red line. There's no line of sight to begin with. But now we have leaves on the trees. A lot of leaves. Now, in that other video, I did about an S9 on the meter. So let's start the car up. So I get the same wattage output. I think I'm doing about 30 watts ish. I don't have the meter hooked up, but it's the same. It's the same whatever it was in the other video. And I do have my S bar uh, up up on the screen. Uh, so let's go ahead. I'm going to start the car. Then we'll, we're going to key up the radio. The car started. And let's see how many S readings I get. Now, remember, I have the simplex repeater on. So when I key up the first time, that's the reading we want. When it replays my voice back, that second reading disregard. That's going to show a high S reading because obviously my simplex repeater is right next to the repeater, so it's going to show a lot more, you know, um, bars. So don't don't look at the second uh, graph or the second part of it after when it's replaying my voice back. If I can hit the repeater, I am about 3.6 miles from my repeater as the crow flies. Now remember, my repeater is in a kind of in a valley, kind of in a hole, and uh, you know, so that's the reason why I don't get very good range where I live. But at any rate, so let's go ahead and key up this. I'm going to talk on this, and then I'm going to unkey it, and then let's see what the what the graph says on here. Radio check, radio check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know if I can hit the repeater. Okay, so I did. But, but it's a big, you can see a big difference. Um, if I remember right, in that video, I was getting about an S9. I'm getting about an S5 right now and like i said everything's the same so very interesting um let's key up the rate let's key up the uh this radio one more time and let's watch the s meter 
Radio check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And yeah, it's about a S5, maybe a little bit lower. Oh, there's my date and time. So that's playing. Um, let me turn that down. Okay, so yeah, I obviously there's a there, there is a, a a difference here. Um, it's a, it's a pretty good difference. So that's kind of shows you the leads do interfere. Uh, you know, with your with your reception, um, obviously, you know how much it's going to interfere depends on how thick the trees are. Uh, you know, so yeah, I mean, it's it's definitely definitely a, a difference. I could, I'm hitting the repeater, obviously. I can make out the audio. I think the audio was clear in the other video. I'll again, I'll post that link so you guys can compare. Um, but I'm going to do it one more time here. And I got to wait for my simplex repeater on key here. Uh, I think it's keyed up. I think it's recording my date and time. I forgot to turn off my date and time announcement before I left. Uh, and I did not set up remote access so I can quickly hop on the tablet here and, and turn it off. Uh, not a big deal. But, okay, now it's off. So now, and also, too, I want to try to make, make uh, a point here is that when I did this now I, tr I I didn't change in none of the settings with my SDR I'm using an SDR that's software that lets me have the S uh, meter on there on my uh, computer um, and obviously I'm remote accessing the repeater from or the, the computer from where I'm at so that's um, how I'm kind of doing this but I try to keep the the SDR calibrate the same way as the other video and i'll show you here what i mean once this thing's done keying up it's playing it recorded now it's playing back the um the date and time here so uh we gotta wait here a minute um but yeah so i try to keep the the calibration the same i didn't touch anything i just started the sdr program i didn't touch none of the calibration just to let everybody know that um, so if you look at it, when it's not being, when the radio is not being used, you can see the noise level that I pick up a little bit of, you know, noise with the, you know, how the S bar, see how the S, like S one's kind of flickering. That's about the same as in the other video. It might've flickered maybe two, but not much different. So I want to point that out. So let's do it one more time. I'm going to key up. Radio check, radio check. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. And I'll turn up the volume here so you can hear the audio. So, yeah, I mean, it's definitely, you can definitely tell a difference. I'll do it one more time. Radio check, radio check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, yeah, it looks like about an S5 max in between. In between. So it looks like about S5 at the max, maybe a little less than that. But uh, hopefully, this all kind of proved the point. That yes, leaves do interfere with your reception. So if you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. Please subscribe. Thank you and have a good day.